Hey, what's up everybody? Um, today, I'm just gonna show you guys something that I bought, which is a little bit different from how I've been doing things before. So I was putting together the crankcases, and while I was doing that, one of the bolts snapped. Now, it's one of the older ones. I've since bought some newer ones. Uh, at the same time, I also bought um, a new set of crankcase bolts at the same time. It's 95701. 0610000 and it's a six millimeter by a hundred millimeter. So it's the longest skinniest bolt um, in the crankcase. And when it was um, torqued to nine foot pounds, which is the spec, uh, it snapped and it snapped about right here where the threads are. And by doing that, what it did was it caused me to have to open up the case again, remove all the gasket material again, and um, kind of fish this bolt out with a drill where I ended up snapping two drill bits because I had to put it at an angle to, to get into it. And then using like a star hex um, head to, to kind of drill it out. So it was a really big pain in the ass and um, I'd like not to do it again. So I did order new bolts. I am gonna replace all these, but um, as kind of like insurance, what I'm thinking about doing is utilizing this bolt kit that I got from Alloy Bolts, which is why uh, we're kind of talking today. So Alloy Bolts, thank you for your order. Um, they give you a bunch of information on how to use stuff. The other thing that they do is they give you the torque specifications and they tell you right up front that their torque specifications are different from the ones that you have um, for whatever your motorcycle is. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and show you how this thing is kitted. So I think there's 32 bolts that go into the uh, engine case of the CB750. You can see CB750, single overhead cam, stainless steel bolt kit. And it comes with like the lower ones, the upper ones, and the oil pan bolts. So these are the oil pan bolts here. It's kitted separately. It's beautifully kitted actually with uh, everything separated, which is nice. Then it's got the upper crankcase bolts here. Um, everything looks good. It looks like it's missing some though. Uh, no, maybe not. So there's one, two, I don't know. It looks like some of them might be missing. Uh, maybe not. No, maybe not. I think, I think it's got just about everything. But it's weird though, because like some of the nuts, you can see some of the nuts are over here that, that obviously go here. So it's not totally upper and lower um, crankcase. I guess these are at the bottom, so they consider it lower. Um, but yeah, everything's here. Looks really nice. I don't know why anybody still uses an AOL account, but other than that, it's really great. I'm looking forward to using these. I'll probably end up using these instead of the replacement bolts that I got because I only bought a few of these and uh, not all of the bolts that go into the engine case are available still from Honda. You can only get a couple of them. Luckily, the long skinny ones are, are still, luckily like these long skinny ones are still available. All right, thanks a lot guys, I appreciate it.